Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about what I bought this month, January edition. Um, I bought a few things and I just wanted to share my thoughts and reviews about them. I've already used all of them so I could um, give you a very detailed review. And without further ado, let's just get right into it. Um, because I don't have that much, which is a great sign. <laughs> um, so first things first, I want to talk about this purse. Um, this is from the brand Bagu. And this is their medium size nylon crescent bag. And I've been looking for a medium size purse because I needed something a little bit more um, bigger than when I, what I was currently or what I was using before this bag, which was um, I was using a just a canvas tote bag that I got for free or I was using um, the Samara Times Claire uh, bag. That one is a little bit too small for everyday use um, because I realized that I carry a lot more now than the usual because I have a dog um, and so um, I also started using my um, this wallet right here this is from Kiana um, it was gifted to me um, by my sister two years ago and I didn't realize I, I was going to use a bigger wallet until now um, because I have in the last year and a half accumulated more cards and so I needed to put that into a wallet that I carry every single day. Um, I have like health insurance card, vision card. I just got a membership to Costco. And so before that I was carrying like a card case, but realized that not all the cards that I need to carry with me every single day is there. So I switched um, to this bigger um, purse, I mean, to this bigger wallet, which means I needed to have a little bit of a bigger purse. And so comes this handy dandy purse. Um, and I really love it. I, I, I have been using it for a month now and I just find it so versatile, like especially this strap that you can extend so you can make it into a sh uh, shoulder bag, just like what I have it now, or you can adjust the strap right here and make it into a crossbody. And I tend to gravitate anyways to um, like crossbody bag because I like my hands uh, free. And so I've been really just loving this. And I love the brand. Um, definitely in my top 10 uh, um, favorite brands of all time. Um, I also like that it's nylon so you can wash it um, when it gets dirty. Um, and it just fits everything that I need. Um, I carry a bunch of <laughs> poop bags um, because of my doggy. I have my wallet here, sanitizer, another bagu like grocery grocery bag, um, my shades when it gets too warm or sunny, and sanitizer, and just like lip gloss. And it just carries everything. And I even have more space. As you can see it has a zipper on each side right here so um, it's nice to kind of have that also to kind of separate a few things in the purse but other than that it's been great I love it um, I did hear that they had a leather version I saw some um, influencer or like on uh, Instagram and um, but she had gotten hers two years ago which I totally missed I didn't realize that but they have a leather version and I'm so bummed because I wanted a leather version but this will do I love it anyways um and I heard that um Bagu is no longer going to um make leather bags I don't know that's what I heard I don't know how true that is um but yeah, so this is the Bagu nylon um, crescent bag in the medium size. Okay, moving right along. Um, next up are kind of like in the, still in the same theme of like fashion 
and um, like accessories. And so I've been working out. I have been working out twice a week and hoping to make that three times a week very, very soon. But um, so I realized that the leggings that I currently have, which I love so much, um, they're from the brand Define Your Inspiration. Um, they are just a little tad bit big on me now. I think I lost a little bit of weight. And so the leggings are falling off when I'm working out. And that's very annoying because I'm having to pull up my leggings each time I do a squat or I do a jumping jack. You know the deal. Um, so I realize I need new pairs of leggings that fits me better. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give my old leggings to my sister because um, it fits her and that's her size. And I got me some new pair of workout clothes. And I have this leggings here, as you can see. Um, they're in this like nude color. They are from the brand Set Active. And I also have a pair of sports bra from them. Uh, these are the Sculptplex like rib um, style. And I first heard about this brand from Alana Davidson on YouTube. And she was uh, talking about this bra and she said she really loves it um, and it's really comfortable for working out. So um, I think it was like the first week of the new year. Um, set active had a warehouse sale so everything was like 40 to 50 percent off but i didn't hear about it until like two weeks later so i only found they only had this on sale so i got um this for i think 24 and some dollars and um they didn't have the leggings anymore and i wanted um like to have a matching leggings as well. So I went into Depop and I did some research and I found this one. Um, it's, of course, it's, you can see it's a different color, but it's the same style and I really love it. I like the style of this. It's actually quite new to me because if you could see in the middle over here, it's, um, it doesn't have the inseam or the seam, uh, even at the back. So it's um, it's all just like one fabric. Um, I thought that I wasn't gonna like this style because I tried a bike shorts before from a different brand and it kind of looks funny on me. It gave me a camel toe and I don't like that. However, this one doesn't. And so um, I've used it already. It's really comfortable. I like that it's high-waisted. I'm very picky when it comes to workout clothes. I like, or even leggings, I like it thin, breathable, and um, flexible so you can do any moves and stretches. And this checks all the boxes. Um, I also like this kind of like ribbing style on the side. It just, this leggings just like hugs you in the right places and it actually does not fall when I'm doing squats or jumping jacks. Um, so I have been loving it so much. Um, and the bra right here, um, it's also very, very comfortable. It's so, it's like stretchy. If you could see closer right here, it's um, rib material. Um, I actually never thought about using rib you know sports bra but i'd say this is one of my favorite style of sports bra and i have to agree with alana that they're very very comfortable so yeah these are the sculptplex um activewear from set active so that's that and in the same theme i also got leggings a pair of leggings from sweaty betty now I have heard of this brand before. I just never really like looked into it because I thought it was just UK, but apparently they ship to US too. And I heard about it from 
recently from Estee Lalonde, and she was talking about this um, high-waisted um, power leggings, and I got mine in this beautiful like green and black color, and it looks like this. Um, and what I like about this style is that um, it's like super thin. I'm not sure if you could tell. It's like super thin material. It's super stretchy. Sorry, uh, someone was banging on the wall or pounding something on the wall. Anyways, I like this material. It's super thin and super stretchy. Um, I also love that it has pockets on the side. Um, and I've tried this on and it feels really, really good. It feels like it will stay put. Um, I have just tried it on, but I haven't really worn it to work out just yet. But I just love the overall like cut of these. It just like, again, it's one of those leggings that just like hugs you in the right places. I'll, like this is like the butt area so it has kind of like this um style and it just um makes your bum look nice when you're wearing these leggings um and it just holds you also in the right places according to their website it's sweat wicking so um it's good for any type of workout like high intensity workout and also jogging so um that's why I got it. And I think they might ha be having a sale right now because I just got an email from them. Um, so get yourself a pair if you've been eyeing or just want to try a different brand of leggings. I have a feeling I'm going to love this and it's going to be up there in like the style of leggings that I like. So that's that. Moving right along, I needed to replenish my sock drawer. I haven't bought new socks in like five years, like comfortable socks, everyday socks. Um, and I decided to get myself some new pair and I got these right here from Girlfriend Collective. I also got this color and like a white that's like a, I don't know what you call this style but it's the i think just like crew socks right just regular um and i have like two more in the wash though they're they're dirty and this one i used the other day so you can see it's dirty but yeah they're super comfortable um and i didn't realize that my socks were in bad condition because when i put this on the new socks on it felt like my socks was wrapped in a blanket. It was so soft and so comfortable like walking around. So I need to remind myself that I need to replenish or refresh my sock drawer every now and then and not wait like five to 10 years. So that's that girlfriend collective socks, super comfortable. Cool. All right, still in kind of the, um, fashion accessories um, category, I needed a new pair of running shoes or walking shoes. I haven't bought one in say 10 years. Um, my current pair is from my sister. I didn't buy it, she gave it to me. And I mean, I'm gonna show you, it's so nasty though. <laughs> Look how bad look at the condition of their shoes but this is the only pair that i have and so realizing that i want to get back into um jogging i was like you know what i just need to get myself a new pair that's really comfortable and um so i got these pair from hoka these are the clifton eight and um, I've seen influencer talk about this on Instagram and also they've been advertising to me on Instagram. So I decided to get myself a pair. I did hear a lot of great things. My mother-in-law bought some too for my father-in-law and they said it's super comfortable. 
and i have to agree they do feel like you're running in clouds and they're so bouncy <laughs> like the first time i put it on i'm like is this really how it feels because it's like literally when i was walking i was like kind of bouncing in the clouds that's how it felt and they're super light as well and so i have been loving these pair i also love this like color um and i was actually funny story i've been looking for the older version i guess they were the clifton seven in the um almond color i saw um sarah i forgot her last name does she go by sarah gray here on youtube talk about the hokas i mean she loves them she's a runner so she uses it to run and even just for leisurely like walking around town she had the clifton seven in the almond color and it just looks really really nice i've been scouring the internet depop um poshmark ebay for this shoes and i can't find any in my size so i was really bummed and and so because of that i just like decided to get the new pair and i i i mean i love the color of this i love that it's off-white and it has like these two pop-up colors um i feel like i could wear this with anything so that's that in the like fashion accessory category next up we're moving into kind of beauty and health so first things first i wanted to talk about this um brow product and this is from the brand Vegamore. Um, it's a uh, eyebrow serum. Okay, if you hear some crazy noise, um, our landscapers are here and I think they're blowing leaf around. Um, so if you hear that noise, hopefully it's not too bad for this video. Um, but anyways, I've been using this um to help regrow my the sparse area of my brows and so far i've been loving it um this is actually my second bottle and i did notice that it is growing there's some hairs that are growing back out and however it's really really slow so it's, it's one of those products that you just have to keep using and um, for a while before you see results. Um, and this is, again, my second tube. And so far, I've been loving it. Will I be using it some more or will I buy a third bottle? I'm not sure because I have heard from a dermatologist on Instagram about this product called Minoxidil. He said to get the 2% version, it's supposed to help hair growth for your brows. So I think I'm going to pause on this um, once I finish this and then try the other one just to see what the difference is as far as like result and all that jazz. But yeah, uh, so far I've been loving that. Um, okay, next up are these items here. And they are from the brand The New Co. Right there. Um, basically, this one is a supplement to help with sleep. Uh, this one is a fragrance like spray to help with stress. And then this one is like sleep drop, also to help with sleep. Um, between these two, I like the drop better. Um, it tastes good because I think it has chicory in it. Huh. No, I lied. I thought it has chicory in it, but it has organic catnip herbs, chamomile, and valerian root, passion flower herbs. And they're all like organic. Um, but I do feel like with this drop, I my sleep is like all the way through and this one whenever i take it i 
do notice that I wake up in between. So um, yeah, this one has also valerian root, 5-HTP, and GABA. Um, all of, okay, I'll get that later. But um, the brand is from the new and they talk about um, using organic ingredients and that um, they do a bunch of like research to um, prove the reason behind their ingredients and kind of like their the mixture of their products. Um, this one, the, sp the fragrance spray, if you're into like earthy scents, you'd like this. Because to me, this smells like, like if I'm walking in the forest, it's more kind of like, I don't know how to describe it, it but it smells really good. Um, it reminds me of a, like a perfume, but I can't name it at this time. But basically um, with this one, it's supposed to help like if you're feeling stressed out or like an anxiety or something like that, you can just like spray this. And apparently the scent has, the scent that they picked, the scent signals something in your brain that helps regulate the stress level of your body when you're starting to feel feel stress and to me i mean just the scent alone and it could just be like i guess for me it's like any scent just well not any scent like fresh clean herbal scent for me just like helps calm me down especially if it's like lavender or chamomile or honey like milky honey smell um helps like calm me down um eucalyptus is another one too that i really really like to like help calm me down when i'm feeling a little stressful but i mean i like the idea i also like the smell so i mean i use it um for that purpose if it's like if, if i feel like it's gonna be a crazy or heavy day at work i would just like spritz this on and go on about my day so that's all the items that I bought in the month of January and thank you for watching. If there are items that you have bought also in the month of January and you want to share them, share your thoughts, you can leave your comments down below and we can chat about it. But other than that, thanks again for watching. I will see you in the next video.